yeah, like reuse them in other continuity. You couldn't. That's why they died. Horrible. That's why they stayed where they were. Or most mm -hmm. of them died anyway. Or a, lot, or a lot of them died, or, and then a lot of them were just like, oh, we're fucked. Yeah, it, it was kind of like that one shot, try to see if we could make it, like, have an entire city, like, Gotham, yeah. going on, and it was just like, no, we can't. Speaking of which, I know that you, uh, you make a really big deal about stuff, like, movies based on comic books and books and so on being very true to the source material. Yeah. So, yeah. did you like the Watchmen movie? Uh, I did and didn't. Only because I knew... The squid? Well, honestly, I think the biggest thing I didn't like about Watchmen was I knew that it was not right. It was not a movie that was going to be taken in the way that it was made originally. It was like back when it was first written... Like the whole tone was going to be different? Or, or well, not oh, the, the, the audience. The audience wasn't going to understand why it was important that everything was going yeah. on the way it was. And but it, again, like, I did. And I found well, out when the movie came out. Yeah, but I'm just saying, it's like you're looking at the, you know, this is the same problem with Transformers. You're talking about, if like... You saw, if you came out of the movie with more memorable, it remembered more besides the blue penis and the penis like Nixon knows, you probably, I think you came away with a lot of the meaning of the movie, if you could get past Yeah, the and that's, and, but see, that's, that was the thing. Like, I, I remember, if you talk to someone, like, normally, you ask, yeah, have you seen Watchmen? Yeah, I've seen blue penis. No, so you've... I almost wish they put underwear on them for the whole movie, just so I people honestly could wish that they stop just, talking about it. I, I just wish that that, that wasn't, a, yeah, like that wasn't a necessity. Honestly, it wasn't. Okay, in the comics, yes, he was. It naked. makes sense. It like, wasn't oh, a necessity it's because he has no, he has no base. Uh, he has no clothes. He's just a, a yeah. batter of like. He's just a uh, particles. It's not, something that well, he doesn't consider. It shows the way that he's like above. Yeah, yeah that's his mentality. He just does not think yeah, about it. He doesn't he's need thinking it. on multiple timelines simultaneously. He's this impossible godlike character that yeah, does so not it's like process Yeah, so sitting there going, one, wondering if you have pants on is not one of the things that are fabricating in the time and space continuum in your mind. What well, actually impressed so, me about the movie is that almost every scene this scene was actually like taken directly from the comic to the point yeah. where I was almost overdoing it. Well, and, and, the only, the only, and the only major change they did is that they eliminated the entire squid uh, and pirate plot lines. But you couldn't. There wasn't enough time. Yeah, and and when they when they all, the, the whole thing with Doctor Manhattan being act, the actual source of the explosion indirectly anyway. Yeah. It actually made a more tangible reason for him to leave than the comic originally did, which was that he eventually was like, "I'm done here." When the other but one's see, like, I kind of like that. Where he's like, in the he's like, "Look, Earth, you yeah. guys suck. I don't need to be here because nothing I do is gonna work for you people." Deuces. But it's it kind of contradicted off. things at the same time because because he wanted to save the whole thing is that the whole point of the whole Mars scene is that it's like oh he does care about humanity to some extent like this is his tie to humanity is this woman yeah and then he just leaves sort of casually at the end of the comic but the movie he leaves because he's almost like this like he's almost like a, this hypothetical I mean this sort of like symbolic martyr for the human race where like he sacrifices yeah. him being there to perpetuate this idea that he attacked the planet and united the planet in fear of him. Yeah. Even though he didn't technically do it. And but it's like, I, don't, I don't know, it was, it was one of those kind of movies where if you were into the comics, you knew the storyline, you probably got, you left that leader, yeah, you left the theater probably having a little bit of like, you know, enjoyment. Yeah. You know, like, I, I liked it, it was a good homage. I, I personally, I didn't hate it. I just knew, I just knew myself that most people were going to come see this are not going to take it seriously. This. Yeah, they're, Okay, and that bought, like I think probably that was the first thing I. Did you end up seeing the movie, Zach? Watchmen? No, I didn't. What movie have you seen? Recently? Yes. I saw a Change Up. Try again. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't really um, go watch movies too often. So. You ever seen Limitless? No. Okay. Um, Source code? Very fine. I, I know, I know. It's, it's okay. <laughs> Oh, what have you been doing lately besides college? Because <laughs> that is not a fun topic. School, <laughs> airsoft, I've been buying real guns, I've been just doing... On that topic, actually on that topic. Yeah. I'm curious about the whole airsoft thing, like, you're sponsored, right? Yeah. How does that work, like, is there like a big audience, like spectators when you do the shows? Not like, really, it's some... it's just that you go and you represent the, I don't know, the, the sponsors, you work your own deal out as a team with yeah. them. And then you just go out, you represent them. Do they pay you? Or do they just give you access to I can't really disclose that. But, yeah. but I guess it just depends on who you're with. If it's a store, if it's like a airsoft field. So you, if you it's, can't say how much you pay, you just can't say anything about what they do. Well, you just, can't I, talk just about rather not. Yeah, you can't uh, really talk about that. But um, I mean, you just you just play. It, really. it varies from contract to contract. Yeah. Usually it's like some, some might provide you with funding. Some might provide you with items. Some might 
typically, yeah. Yeah, typically and so it's, 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 it's what I was one it's what I was wondering about because you always hear about like NASCAR sponsors. It's very obvious what the point of that is. You get the big logos and the cars, big massive, like massive right. amounts of money through yeah. advertising and helps fund the team and stuff like mm -hmm. that. Yeah. But then you have like sponsored Magic the Gathering players, and mm -hmm. I'm like, well, it's, but see, what it's, is the it's sponsorship? Usually, like, they're, they're two mean? different. They're, those are two yeah. different types yeah. of things. Because a and Magic tournament, you have, you can sponsor like a prize, that's or you can sponsor like about, ladder because, rankings and yeah. you know facility to do it. And of course, NASCAR, the whole bit of that is just advertise the crap out of everything. Because so, their cars on TV and, and that's what I always wondered about because um, I knew it couldn't be an advertising thing mm -hmm. like it usually means. You're so talking specifically. Like, you're talking about the yeah, airsoft. So like, it's not really an advertising thing, you know. It's, it's like more when like, you say sponsor, it means you're getting something for your doing affiliation something. with this specific right. group. Yeah, but I, just, <laughs> I don't know. If you and it does like, vary from yeah, you know people, yeah. person, sport, you know, whatever. It, it, what it, it just so like, depends. So like, if, if you, you take a random pool of like sponsored airsoft teams, for example, you get like certain people that it's like. Oh, we get discounts at the store, mm -hmm, or other yeah. people might get free gear, or other people might get like access to right. certain mm -hmm. tournaments or transportation. Or the sponsorship or might pay like for for the um, for every single competition you go to the entry fee. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. I might so pay for the entry fee. Free, and or the and do you, the you guys do uh, in the beginning? You show your sponsors, don't you? Yeah, in the beginning. Yeah. 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 Just trying to realize it. I spent a little while <laughs> editing the sponsors onto your flag. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I figured out how to do that CS5, but I'm not too. Technical into doing that. Photoshop 7. Yeah. Never upgrading. Wow, that's sad. <laughs> it works. Why would I?